So Chris, how's the new school? It's awful. I hate it. Everybody's mean to me because I'm not rich. Oh, no, Chris, that's horrible. All right, look, I'll tell you what. I'll call Daddy and I'll see if there's anything he can do. Good, because I haven't been this miserable since I had to throw Rocky Balboa out of the Shamrock Meat Company. Look, I'm, I'm sorry. I can't have you in here punching the meat. I mean, it's really not too many things you can't do in here, but that is one of them. What about Paulie? He's having sex with the meat. Hey, Rock, I'm porking it. Uh, that's a good one. Phew. Well, that's enough fun for one day. I'm sweating more than a non-legacy applying to Yale. <laughs> <laughs> doing here Chris welcome to the skull and bones society this is where the most powerful men in the world are groomed for their futures every president every CEO every douchebag named Ryan Seacrest the skull and bones society has been a part of my family for decades and we want you to become a member really Wow cool excellent you get your own stock portfolio a percentage of the 9-11 victims fund and the best medical care on the planet you'll be kept as healthy as a horse we now return to Japanese girls think small versions of things are really cute. Peter, have you seen this tuition bill? Morningwood Academy is charging us $30,000. Well, it looks like we're all going to have to take second jobs. I guess I'll see if I can get my old gig back selling butt scratchers at the ballpark. Butt scratcher! Butt scratcher! Can't you butt scratcher here? Butt scratcher! 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 Chris, come here, you'll love this. The first Thursday of every month, we go to a local orphanage, pick out a kid, fill out all the paperwork, and then don't take him home. It's hilarious. That sounds kind of cruel. No, no, you'll love it. It's great. Come on. Come on in. Your family's waiting in here. There are toys and a puppy and food that's not served from warming trays. Come on, you gotta want it. Oh, you gotta do better than that. Okay, I guess you don't want a new family, toys, and a puppy. Hi, everybody, I'm home. Hi, hey, how are you? Well, tell us everything, sweetie. How's school going so far? It's great, Mom. I got powerful connections now, thanks to Grandpa. Chris, I give you a hug, but I'm exhausted from working two jobs to pay your tuition. I've been selling butt scratches. Butt scratcher? No, Peter. Butt scratcher? Peter, no. Butt scratcher? No. Butt scratcher. Dad, you, you, you got an extra job just to put me through school? We all did, Chris. Meg and I have been working nights. I'll take the one on the right. Well, once again, Meg, I'll be back in an hour. And I got a job following fat people around with a tuba. Stop it! Cut it out! I have a glandular problem! That'll be sixty dollars. You wanted to see me, Grandpa? Yes, Chris, your pledge period is over. The Skull and Bones elders are now ready to admit you to our ranks. As is customary with all our new members, you now have to spend seven minutes in the closet with our most senior member. We don't start the clock until the door closes. You know, Grandpa, I don't think I want to go through with it. We all had to do it, Chris. Now get in there. No, I mean, I think I want to go back to my old school. My family's working so hard to pay my tuition here, and I feel bad. Is there any way you could get me back into James Woods High? Well, I suppose I could pull some strings. If that's really what you want, Chris. It is. All right, consider it done. Thanks, Grandpa. Sorry, Master Herbert. Sorry. You better get your ass in that closet, Pewter Schmidt. Yes, sir. I'm so tired of you.